Treehouse of Horror 2 originally aired on October 31st, 1991, which features three more spooky tales. During their trip to Morocco, the Simpsons stumbled upon a mysterious marketplace where Homer couldn't resist buying a monkey's paw. The vendor warned them about the consequences of making wishes with the paw, but Homer disregarded his advice, believing that he knew best. Upon returning home, the family had different ideas about how to use the paw. Maggie wished for a golden pacifier, and Bart wished for the family to become rich and famous. At first, everything seemed to be going Going great, and the family became the talk of the town, appearing on everything from billboards to t-shirts. However, the fame and fortune soon attracted negative attention, and the family became the subject of public backlash. Lisa decided to make a wish for world peace, but little did she know that her wish would attract the attention of the aliens Kang and Kodos, who saw the Earth as vulnerable and easy to conquer. Homer decided to make another wish. This time, he wished for a simple turkey sandwich without any weird surprises. To his relief, the sandwich appeared to be perfect, except for the turkey being a little dry. Later on, Ned Flanders found the monkey's paw and used it to make a wish to get rid of the aliens, freeing the human race and becoming a hero. However, his subsequent wish for a castle made Homer angry and jealous. In Bart's nightmare, his mind has taken on supernatural abilities that allow him to manipulate reality itself. He is a godlike figure that can read the thoughts of others. This has turned the town into a fearful place where everyone is forced to be happy and cater to Bart's every whim. One afternoon, Bart returns home from school and demands to watch his favorite show, Krusty the Clown, but his father Homer refuses. In a fit of rage, Bart teleports Homer to the football stadium, replacing the football and sending him crashing into the field post. Seeking revenge, Homer tries to attack Bart with a chair, but Bart turns him into a jack-in-the-box instead. Marge, desperate to help her family, takes Bart and Homer to Dr. Marvin Monroe. The doctor suggests that the two of them should spend more time together doing father-son activities. Homer takes Bart to a baseball game, fishing, shooting a BB gun, church, and an amusement amusement park, and Bart starts to soften as he enjoys the quality time with his dad and decides to turn Homer back to his normal self, and the nightmare ends. In Homer's surreal dream, he finds himself fired for dozing off on the job. In a twist of fate, he becomes a grave digger and accidentally falls asleep in one of the open graves. Meanwhile, Mr. Burns and Smithers are in a search of the perfect brain for their diabolical experiment to create the ultimate worker. They stumble upon the snoozing Homer, thinking he's already departed this life, and decide to take his brain for their twisted scheme. Mr. Burns is utterly disappointed with the result and orders Smithers to return Homer's brain to its rightful place. But things take a bizarre turn when the robot falls over and crushes Mr. Burns, leaving the rich tycoon in need of emergency medical attention. Homer wakes up in a cold sweat and realizes that it was all just a nightmare. However, to his horror, he discovers that Mr. Burns' head is still attached to his body in the real world, which Homer goes on to complain that he hates having two heads. Over Overall, Treehouse of Horror 2 is a spooky addition to Season 3 of The Simpsons that you definitely need to check out if you haven't already. If you want to see another Treehouse of Horror episode, then click this video right here.